And I think, again, this is huge. This is really where we should focus. We didn't change anything on the network, nothing. We took your product, we put it in place, we connected it, and it worked. TC Communications was contacted by the system integrator Tom Blumenshine after the initial system where TC Communications was not involved had critical failures bringing down their fire network. This is an emergency radio communications network covering two counties and six cities, going over 12 radio sites with 15 microwave hops. Once we implemented the TC gear, and we actually interfaced it with, with as you said, the voter system, they immediately noticed an improvement in the signal quality as far as how there was less interference, it, it sounded crisper, cleaner uh, than they had experienced before. So that was definitely an improvement. The quality of the audio, the quality that they were getting improved significantly. Ten years ago, TC Communications launched our Jumbo Switch family of products, our multi-service Ethernet platform. The card I'm about to share with you, the TC3846-6, is part of many interfaces that make up this family of products, such as telephone, modem over IP, T1, serial, dry contacts, and the list goes on. Over the last nine years, our TC3846-6 radio over IP card has become a very reliable and popular choice amongst public safety agencies where critical communications are a necessity. Since its deployment nine years ago, the TC3846-6 has been tested and evaluated by multiple counties and agencies across the country for their police, fire, emergency, E911 communications, where critical communications for backhaul between transceivers and dispatch have been a necessity. We're at the East Shore Radio Network head end. This is where all the microwave links that we provided for the East Shore Radio Network terminate. Entree Solutions 2 worked with the East Shore Radio Network back, we started in 2014, replacing a lot of their older lease lines and analog trunks that they had supporting their mobile network. By eliminating those lines and providing Cambium point-to-point -point microwave radios, we were able to reduce the total cost that the East Shore Radio Network has been paying for their lease lines by $84,000 a year, a significant savings for them. What we did is we took those lease lines and we now are transporting them over the Cambium point-to-point -point radios. Using our TC3846 radio over IP solution is the fastest and simplest way to migrate to IP without the expensive overhaul or forklift upgrades. By implementing the microwave along with the TC jumbo switches, what we were actually able to do was eliminate the lease lines that the city was using with their, their mobile radio system. Now, rather than going over traditional lease lines, having traditional POTS lines and T1 lines, it now is carried over the microwave connections and then down to the TC communication jumbo switch. By using existing fiber, microwave, and ethernet network, configuration and deployment of the TC3846-6 is easy, virtually eliminating any downtime, and can be seamlessly integrated into your existing network. Here we have the individual channel receivers that are monitoring the different channels that are spread around the East Shore radio network. Above them are two Motorola receivers that are feeding into the SNV12 voter. The SNV12 voter is then connected back to the TC communications equipment and the channels are spread throughout the ring. The TC3846-6 uses a TDM over IP engine which means all the audio channels are uncompressed 64K full bandwidth. This allows us to pass through all audio channels, pilot, guard tone, and status tones for voting applications, as well as dry contacts for PTT and COR. Here we have the rear of the Motorola receivers as well as the individual channel monitors. They are all wired back into the SNV12 voter unit. Here at the SNV12 voter unit, we can see the 47 different individual channels that are all wired, and they come down and terminate 
into the TC Communications Jumbo Switch. The Jumbo Switch is populated with a mixture of two and four wire cards and they terminate uh, both of those connections. They have the capability to perform dry contact push to talk, however at this location we do not need them. The TC3846 can also be used for point to point and point to multi point applications. By point to multi point we mean each port is individually IP addressed, so each port can then be transported out to its own remote address. With any Ethernet network, it is important to remember that different paths will have different latencies. With that, the Jumbo Switch TC3846-6 uses the jitter buffer to null out these differences, allowing for a clean, uninterrupted output at the voter site. The microwave did a fantastic job with delivering the payload between you know, the head end uh, and, and the receiver sites and the transmitter sites. And then TC did a great job sometimes taking maybe something that may have been a little bit over the threshold, but still being able to process it and, and not dropping packets, not, not uh, having the buffer underruns. And that was definitely a major problem that we had with the other product. And I believe most likely that's where that product failed. The project has been completed and was completed back in October 2014. Today, September 2016, we have not had a single outage with the Cambian radios or any of the other product that has been introduced into this project. We're very proud of what we've done here. The cost savings that we have allowed them to to experience and, and of course hopefully allowed them to use those cost savings to provide other services for their community. The solution Tom mentioned with our TC3846-6 has been up and running for two and a half years of no downtime or failures. There are plans this year to add four more sites to this radio network. Thank you very much for your time today. I hope you've learned something about radio over IP and TC communications TC3846-6 radio over IP gateway card.